What is the crack lads? We're back with yet another video, smashing them out today. Uh, hopefully you guys get a bit of help from these. So we're going to be showing you guys now how to get a free five-star player uh, from the nominating contract. So these are for coins. Obviously you can see they're the coins. These two are coins only. Um, so you just have to get coins if you do want to buy those. And obviously Mbappe is a beast. He would be the one to get. But these players here are all nominating contracts and there's a couple of hidden gems in them, right? So um, I will cover the Liga MX ones again uh, at a later date because these players, there is a couple of hidden gems in here. I would say even somebody like Gignac, who is uh, on D form, he could be somebody as a deep line forward. He could be somebody to look at it eventually down the line, especially as he is only a four-star nominating contract. But we got, we're going to focus on getting a five star nominating contract today if you've missed my review on these check it out it was just uploaded a while ago so check that out we go through all the recommendations but as you will notice here these players all of these here Nunes, Witzel, uh, Sterling, Rudiger, Perisic, Pogba, Onana um, and Skamaka they are all five star players. So if you guys want to get one of these players 100% for free, I'm going to show you how to do it. So this is all you have to do. We're going to do it in real time. I'm just going to skip, obviously, um, the match and fast forward that on while I do that. But we're going to go back out to the main menu. And obviously there was there was a free five star agent video that I did before. This is very similar to that. So instead of it being an objective now, it's actually within the Dream Team matches itself. So we're going to go into Dream Team, into Match. We're going to go to events, which are here, and you're going to see here that there is four uh, new events, right? Well, obviously, this is uh, an event that they had for the starter against the, the AI. So when we go into this, you will see that the rewards for this one are a five-star nominating contract. So literally, all we need to do in this competition is uh, to win get enough points to actually get it you don't even need to win or lose you can play 10 matches and lose every match 10 nil you still amass points but when we enter into that you will see here that all we need to do is amass um 4, points for uh the or 250 coins for points for the reward of what sixteen thousand trainer points and then the main reward is a five-star nominating contract. So all we literally need to do, lads, is with the information here, is play and get as many points as we possibly can per match. And we're going to be coming up against a different team. And then we need to get all of these. So once you get 500 coins, you're going to get 40,000 GP. And you get 1,000 points, you're going to get 40,000 GP again. You're going to get loads of trainers. And then at the end, you're going to get a four-star nominating contract and you were going to get a five-star nominating contract. So there's a ton of GP on offer here. Like looking at it here, there's like what? 40, 40, 40, 40, 40. There's 200,000 GP as well as a four-star and a five-star nominating contract and loads of programs. So literally, lads, all we need to do is go in. You play it on any difficulty that you want. You can set that here, right? You also can AI control the game. So you don't even need to play the matches. You literally just do the tactical stuff. And this is the same as people used to do with simming the matches back in my club literally put down the controller go and have a cup of tea or chill out um and it doesn't make a difference whether you win lose or draw now i would probably play this match on legend to test it out i'm actually going to be testing this out for a video so i'm going to be playing it anyway but that's all that you need to do so um once you do that as well you have your game plan right so in your game plan now you can have a squad but you can also pick your squad by um player bonus stats so it does it for you so these will put the players that all get the bonus into it for you. And you'll see the little tick there beside them. Now, what this does is it actually improves the it actually improves how many points you get for the bonus. So you'll see there that if I play this match on legend difficulty with the players with the squad that I have at the moment, I'm going to get a bonus of a multiplier of 2.6 for the match level, because I'm playing on legend. If you change that, it goes down. So say you put it on regular, which is much easier. It goes down to 1.45. So I'm only going to get 691 points per victory. But if I put it up to legend, right, I'm going to get 1,238 points per victory. So I realistically only need two wins. But if I go into my game plan here, and I press square, I will see that there's one or two players that aren't getting the boost in my squad. So Paddy V, Upamecano, and Romario, as well as Kimmich. And this applies to the reserves as well. So are the subs. So any of your subs here that don't get the boost are not going to give you the boost there. So for me, if I go into this and I go into team and I go into auto pick players and I choose by bonus stats, it's going to fill my squad with all the players that I have here. 
And then my substitutes are going to be the same. So they've all got ticks beside them. They're going to get that bonus. Makes it a little easier for yourself. When I go back here now, I'm now getting 1,675 points per victory. So when you play that and you win that, even if you just play this on top player, you're going to get 1,200. If you play it on superstar, you are going to get 1,449. So I would definitely recommend playing it on legend, see what the AI is like, get your two wins, bang it out and get your five star nominating contract. So I'm going to do that. And then the next part of this video is going to be me showing you guys what happens next. So I'll talk to them. All right, lads, so we've just finished our match. We've just finished the event. And you're going to see here 3-1 victory, obviously, against Wolves. And this was on top player. You can check out my matches against the AI in which I played these. I haven't recorded. So this is just the purposes of this video. But once we get back out here into the main menu, it doesn't pop up dynamically on the screen like it, did, like it does with the objective. But when you get back out here, it will pop up here. So once you have this completed, you will get all your rewards in your inbox. So you can see there that we have a total of 3,529 points. So we're well above what we needed to get everything. So once we go back out here to the main menu, we are going to see that we will be able to sign the nominating contract. So when we go into the contract and go to the player uh, that we want to pick, we will be able to sign in for 100% free. Now, a lot of people, well, sometimes you might forget to check your inbox for it. So I already have two nominating contracts in here. You will see in the top right-hand corner of the screen, that's why I've left the, video, the face off, um, the webcam off. You will see in the player transfers here with the nominating contract that I have got two five-star nominating contract coins and I've got three four-star and then I've got a one, uh, one three-star and two two-stars. So we are going to be looking to get back into our inbox here to claim all of our rewards in which will be our five-star nominating contract, which will be here in a second. So we go into this, very simply. There we go, five-star nominating contract. We're going to redeem that, and that is the event reward, the ultimate event reward. We also get all our trainer points and all our GP and all of that good stuff as well. Now, when we go back into the actual contract itself again, we have got three five-star and four four-star, as you can see from our rewards for playing that starter cup. So there you go, lads, and then you'll just be able to sign whoever that you want from the new season kickoff player transfers player list. I'm going to be signing Nunes, as far as I know here. Um, that is who I signed. So yeah, he goes up to 91 overall center forward, absolute unit, and I'm looking forward to training him up and turning him into a bit of a beast. Check out my review of these as well. I will leave a link in the description below. But that is pretty much it, lads. So you just sign whoever you want, use your nominating contract, and that is it. It is a nice little reward, obviously, if you are looking to, to jumpstart your, your squad and you haven't been playing long, especially for newcomers. A lot of people don't know the ins and outs of Dream Team yet, so I will leave a couple of links in the description below and a link or two for my videos here for, uh, you know, newcomers or whatever. So that is it, lads, a free five-star player. Again, there seems to be one every season, so but let me know who you buy. I'll talk to you in a bit. Peace.